Tonight, a 46-year-old man is dead after he was allegedly killed by his own son. Police say both the father and son pulled out guns during a family fight. NBC6's Jamie Garola is live in Leisure City, where it all happened. And Jamie, it almost seems like a scene from a Wild Wild West movie. Yeah, that's right. And neighbors tell us that they could hear the gunfire from inside their homes tonight. Police are still investigating exactly what happened, and that 23-year-old son has not yet been arrested. The deadly shooting happened around 9.30 last night in southwest Miami-Dade, near 297th Terrace and 161st Court. When police arrived, they found the father, 46-year-old Kirsten Williams, shot multiple times. Neighbors say they could hear the gunfire. Me and my friends were just hanging out here in the backyard, and we heard about like 10 shots go off, so we uh, ran inside. I was watching TV, and I heard something, but I'm not realized that there was shots. Police say the shooting stemmed from a domestic dispute and an argument between the mother and father. Units on scene made contact with a mother and son within that residence who explained that there was a dispute between the victim and the mother uh, in which the son attempted to intervene. When the 23-year-old son stepped in, police say both he and the father took out their guns, exchanging gunfire. The son wasn't hit, but the father was. He was rushed to the hospital but did not survive. People who live close says shootings here are unusual. Uh, that's not our neighborhood because, I mean, our neighborhood's small and quiet. It's literally Christmas is around the corner and then this stuff happens and you think like, wow, like this is like the worst timing. Now, police have not said what the fight was all about. Reporting live in Southwest Miami-Dade, Jamie Garola, NBC6 News.